What is up, guys? This is Pinzo back with another video today, and what I have for you guys is some Faye. Faye is one of those mid laners that in solo queue, you know, in, in just public games, whatever you guys are hopping into, is really good. She's actually really good at carrying your team. She has big team fight potential with her ultimate. She has a lot of gank potential with her ultimate as well, and she can really just, like, you box out people in mid. She could be really good. So, this is one of those games where I wanted to see if I could cover some of Faye's weaknesses, and her main weakness is that she's very susceptible to ganks right her only peel ability is her ultimate she has a slow but it's not very good at keeping you alive in a gank so with that we build golem's gift and Spellbreaker, give us a little bit of physical defense and a little bit of magical defense and see if we can survive a little bit longer and it ended up working pretty well so hopefully you guys enjoy if you do leave a like comment subscribe but we'll jump right into it we're gonna save peaches too late i saved peaches you got timed out for spamming characters i don't know i don't know I don't know what you're what you're typing over there, but you got you got that's what you got timed out for. Oh, well, it's actually so illegal that Faye right click needs three autos on archers at level one. I was gonna go for that, but he's pulling it away from me. Oh wait, it's a lobber. Lobber's playing Countess support. Grux, it's Grux solo. Okay. Interesting. be your countess better mid laner i would probably rather have a countess to be honest i think they do very similarly in lane they have different good and bad matchups but i think they do fairly similarly in lane and uh i think countess is like if out of my mid laner i would rather have a countess late game than a shinbi shinbi's really good but i don't want that out of my mid laner you know Oh my god, I missed my cannon. This guy's actually making a monkey rotation to uh, solo lane right now. Missed a bunch of minions there, but I just want to uh, clear that as fast as possible. Look at me, look at me. Fellas, look at me. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I can kind of just eat Countess damage there. She has no mana. Like, she, there's no way she kills me. I'm going to base, though. Drongo's got mid. Well done, Drongo. Going to the correct lane, bro. I love to see that shit. Feels so good when I, like, gank duo and then take his wave and he goes mid and eats the wave. Oh, my God. People that know how to walk around the map is literally just my favorite people. That's my favorite kind. They MMR matters. I mean, not Ometa City MMR. Like, realistically, it just does not matter. Like, just in the most real sense of mattering or not, it does not. Like, it is... Again, it is all that we have, right? So to an extent, like, do people care about it? Yeah, obviously, right? But does it matter? No, it really doesn't. But like, it is, again, it is all that we have. Just an E. Right-click me. Or not. He's a nerd. He doesn't want to waste his right-click on me when the wave's coming. I need another point in my right click. He actually just RNG gets away with Ray buff. Yep. Just gray buffs out of there, man.
I got a good slow there, but I can't chase. I don't have, I have zero mana. I really can't follow that. All right, it stinks that my crunch dies, but I just actually can't follow that. I'm going to see... I don't know, man. Do I go... Do I go Spellbreaker second? I could go Time Warp second. I don't know. I kind of like this game one. I'm going to try it again. I'm just going to go Spellbreaker second. The downside, again, I just have zero mana with this build. Really the main downside. But going Caustica third kind of solves that issue. We'll see. We'll see what I can chef up. Oh my god. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. Don't worry, don't worry about anything that, that you guys are watching right now. No, I mean, I hit, I got all, I got every CS in that wave. Don't just don't, don't go, don't go back and watch it. Okay. Die full clear with rank two RMB because I'm ahead. If I was even, then I wouldn't. But This guy's actually ganking my crunch again. That's a, insane. It's actually insane that they just went and ganked my uh, my Greystone again. I'm just gonna ping on my way, man. I'm just gonna walk over. Dude, the Countess just warded somewhere, but I don't know where. I'm gonna walk in. Ball, dude. I don't care. Oh, I hit him too. <laughs> he hugged the tower too much. He hugged the tower and died for it. And my crunch stopped the Gideon rotate. Really nice. What the fuck? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. He's dead. He's dead. That's unfortunate. All right, well, that's kind of unfortunate that my crunch ends up dying. I'm just going to base. I thought he had that. I thought he had it. All right, got my golem's gift. I should be pretty hard for Kalari to kill right now. I don't have stasis yet, so it's still a little bit awkward, but... Like, what can I go second to solve mana issues? That's the question. I mean, it would have to be, like, time warp. Be time warp and then spellbreaker, caustica, something. I don't know. Maybe I try it. I mean, it's Countess support and she's behind. I probably don't need a whole lot of magic defense early this game. I can probably grab it a little bit later. Just saving my abilities for when both waves are here. No longer missing. He's back. Oh, no. Oh, I'm shitting on him? Okay. Oh, my God. I'm still shitting on him? Kalari has no idea why I'm so tanky. No! She's alive! Kill her! Bro! No! Oh my god! Shit! That was so close. That was actually so close to just absolutely dumpstering those guys in a 2v1. It's worth it because I got the shutdown. The uh, the Gideon was 3-0. and oh. Totally worth it for the shutdown. But... The fact that I almost killed that dude is crazy. Absolutely crazy. That's all Golem's gift, by the way. Dude insta-kills me if I don't have Golem's gift. He did miss his ult as well. He ulted to follow my flash. So, he didn't use it on me. So close, bro.
<sighs> Close. All right. Well, honestly, dominance asserted. And Gideon got destroyed in the 1v1, so. What are you doing, Lobber? Like, actually, what are you doing? Doesn't really do any damage. I don't really know why he's here to, to hit me in mid for no reason. He's probably just mad because I ganked his lane a couple of times. Oh, he's going... Uh, He went tank crest on support, too. The, the Countess went tank crest, so they're not going to have cleanse. die no she didn't eat another there's no way she didn't eat a tower shot no way that's so sad it's actually insane that she only ate one tower shot on that dive what does she have i mean just malady i guess i ate a nex but look how much her ult did 200 damage to me man gideon dies for it too that's fine I mean, like, again, if they're going to start sitting on me now in mid, like, that's fine. It really opens up the rest of my map. Kind of whatever. If I have my ult there, then they all die. Not quite have it. Were we playing in PC first round in PCC? We're playing some random team that I've never heard of before. Like, some team that I've actually never heard of. I don't know a single player on their team. Enemy tower under siege. Black, you're off. Have a good one, Linus. Minus, more like minus. So they killed him. I think Kalari's around here. There she is. Kind of rude, but whatever. Gideon's going to run at me now. I get it, bro. I get it. Your Kalari did have my HP. Now you want to walk towards me. No gold. I don't want to base yet. Close to my crest. I really want to just get my crest and base. Alright, crest complete. I'm gonna base for stasis. Make sure that I live over the through the next uh through the next round of Kalari gank I live. More it's honestly it's better for, it's more impactful for the Gideon ult than the Kalari ult. Like I can stasis Kalari ult, but it's a little bit better for the, the Gideon. Just a lot of damage that I can very reliably stop, right? I want to see if I can do something in left here. Looks like we're just cooked before I get there. Now we're just cooked. Flurry flash. Oh, I wonder if they have a ward there. I just kind of have to sit back. Like, he's not doing anything. He's staring at me, which is epic. It just doesn't... I don't care. And I know you don't have Countess ult. I watched you use it. Okay. Alright, like, I guess you can walk in and then flash away for no reason. Like, I just don't know what we're doing here. The Countess can queue out of my ult. The TB can't get out of it. I'll just base for time warp. That's fine. You see if your crest is ready to build. It's in the bottom right. You have a little progress bar on it. Like, obviously, it's gone now because I have it, you know, finished. But, uh, yeah, there's a little progress bar in the bottom right. It's uh, down, down here.
Might have seen me. I kind of want to hit this mid wave. Oh, she got her ult off. I should have ulted sooner. I didn't think I was close enough. But when I right when I walked in, I didn't think I was close enough to ult. But. stasis this but I will okay big fine I'm just following my crunch I'm just following the dude with the crowd control oh my god get fucking sniped bro the Kalari here I kind of want to leave and I'll stick around with my crunch. I don't have a whole lot of mana left to fight, but. Fine, she hits me. I'm not the one that she can kill. Like, only she's only going to be able to kill my crunch there. That's a pretty good fight for us. We got the fang. We killed a couple of people. Very nice. I'm going to go Spellbreaker. I'm going to try this out. Hopefully the uh, mana region that I have from Time Warp is enough before I get Caustica, because uh, I'm not getting any more. Not getting any more mana either. I do want blue buff. It's 17 minutes. I'm going to take it. If it was like six, if it was like, you know, 15 minutes or it was the previous blue buff, I'd probably leave it for him. But this late and I'm really big, I'm going to take it. I also would not take it if I wasn't ahead. Like, I mean, I'm five and two. Like, I'm pretty, I'm pretty solidly in the game right now. Oh, my Drongo's going to die in mid. Not coming. I am not coming. I hope he lives. that she actually queued through my E. Alright, well, they get my flash. Flari's in right, so I should be good to base. I don't think Countess kills me here, so... Alright. Now I have my magic defense. Guy's pen. This guy has no damage. Okay. I should be good. I, I don't think their magic dealers can kill me anymore. Not until they get actual items online. Let's try crunch. I'm on my way. Oh, my right click didn't make it over the wall. Big... <laughs> I've actually yoinked every river buff from import this game. Alright. Uh, I kind of just want to get my, my, my thing online, my defense item, my spell breaker or whatever that shit's called. Right? Spell breaker? Yeah. 300 gold. I just want to get this online. It'll make me really hard to kill. Like, at this point in the game, it falls off a little late game, but with the Gideon building the way he's building, I'll be really hard for them to kill. What am I cooking? It's like a hybrid Fey build. I I mean, I kind of got lucky to queue into Kalari. Like, I think, I think Golem's gift first item is almost only good against an enemy Kalari, but... I'm gonna get kind of salted. There it is. Okay. I mean, that's three in mid. I didn't know that the Countess was missing. Unfortnite for me. I needed to either stasis instantly or ult instantly, and I did neither, and I just ate most of that Gideon ultimate for no reason. I needed to... I, 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 didn't, I didn't know what I wanted to do. I, didn't, I needed to have that option made up before he went in. Like, if Gideon ults me here, I need to... I'm gonna ult him. Or if Gideon ults me here, I'm gonna instantly stasis, right? I need to do that before he goes on me. 
Much hesitation. My ping so high, it's just how it is, man. I don't know what you want me to say. All I gotta say about it, get shit on by a guy on 80 ping. You know? That's all I gotta say about it. I still cook people on 80 ping. All right, I'm going to grab my Spellbreaker before this fight. It's a lot of power. I'm 265 right now. Once I finish this, this is like 400 almost. Okay, 350. A little bit less than I thought it was. I was overestimating 20%. Well, this isn't even, this isn't even correct. It's 15%. Spell, spell Bubble gives you 15% power. That's The, the tooltip isn't even correct. It's interesting. Kind of checking for Kalari. There she is. I was going to say, I want to know if Kalari's trying to triple jump into the pit. Load. Trying to keep my spell bubble as long as possible because it get, makes me do a lot of extra damage. I still have my spell bubble somehow. We're balling. We're balling. Spell bubble intact. Junked. Junked. I fucking whiff. Don't worry about that. Spell bubble is no longer intact. This guy's still dead, though. I missed. He's still dead. Playing for the blink. There it is. That tanky? Oh, he is. It's true silver bracelet. Like, why well, I don't do any damage to this guy. What is this? It's because I don't have any damage in my build. Downsides of, of, of tank. Well, okay, I'm not really tank. Hybrid of hybrid fey. Any new info on the new game mode? Uh, no, I don't have info on it. As far as what I would want it to be, I've talked about this before. I'm holding out for 3v3v3. So three teams of three, king of the hill. Like a multi-round game mode. First to three wins, wins, right? Like, that's what I'm holding out for. That's what I want. Oh, shit. I just walked into that. I didn't see him there. Fuck. Rip spell bubble instantly. Okay. He'll be back in 60 seconds. What are we doing? I'm kind of watching my crunch. Uh, I'm just really far out. Make it through the Gideon bubble either. Dead to Drongo, surely? Yep. Oh my god, what is happening? Yerio, stop bodying! She bot blocking me! I thought she was going to kill me on purpose. I thought she was going to ult. My ult there looks really dumb because obviously she's going to queue out. I thought she was going to have to ult the Drongo. So I was going to ult her. I was, was pre-ulting her ult so that it would pull her out, but... Okay. I need mana regen so badly. Could have followed my team sooner. I should have followed them closer. Like, I'm, I'm really big. I really should just be fighting as much as I can right now, to be honest. I should just be, I should just be walking with my crunch wherever he goes. I'm there. I need, I need like 300 gold, 200 gold to get uh, both tier two here, two tier, tier who's here I think he's trying to get me to step up here I really don't want to yeah I figured they were on it I just I'm not walking into that 
Kind of surprised they did kill it already. That was faster than I thought they were going to, but I can't really do much. Defense time. We're not really behind. Like that prime is good for them. It, it helps them. It helps them stabilize. But we're not really behind. This is primal fang tooth coming up. That's kind of bad. Oh, they don't have a. It's that's a short prime. They don't have a fang tooth yet. Their prime is thirty seconds shorter. So that's actually not that bad for us. It obviously it takes it off the map for us. We can't get fang or can't get prime now, right? So it slows down the game for them, which is what they want. But. Uh, it is not the worst thing that could happen. Kind of just have to blanket, blanket the map with wards here. I thought I would get. I thought I was gonna get the kill. No reason for me to walk in there. I really wanted to walk it that Gideon, but there's. I can't. There's no reason. Guy a flash, who knows? Nice job. My bubble. Ouch. You gonna go in? He's gonna go in. That catches me. That's so sad. I think I have to stasis the death mark. Honestly, I probably stasis on the ground in the blue buff and then flash out after the stasis. To be honest, that's probably the play. But I think, yeah, I was going to say, these guys should die for that. I'm really surprised I didn't hit Tim Twin Blast with my ultimate. Maybe I didn't. He cleansed. I don't know. I was really surprised to see my ult only pull Gideon and not Twin Blast. That was really unfortunate. I thought I had them both. Kill that guy. Nice. 1 HP. Nice, slow, nice. Good kill. I think this guy can just keep going. He has ult. Okay, he act that was really, really close. I thought he was not going to use it. I actually thought he was just going to die with his ult. That was almost really bad. They have tainted. Someone has it. Guy has tainted. I need them to run. I really want to I, I really want to wait in base for my item. Yeah, I'm going to. As long as they're not in the middle of a fight, we're good. Alrighty, I'm on my way. Ult is ready. Their jungler is dead for another five seconds. Yeah, we're not pulling anything. I mean, that's fine. That's their whole Prime gone, right? Like, they did. To be fair, they had a bit of a power play there with Prime. That's their whole Prime wasted. Not really wasted. Again, like, the, the longer they stall the game, the more likely that they can actually come back and do something. So, waste is maybe not the right word. I want to hit that mid wave. I just want to make sure it's pushing away from us. Never heard of the band Gunship? Not me. And that's good damage on that Countess. I want to help, but I don't know what I can do. Okay. Can't really get in. I'm trying to. I'm trying to follow. I'm just trying to hit who I can hit, man. I'm not really able to single target somebody, which is what I want to do on a... Uh... Oh, wait, I didn't stop the Kalari back. That's so unfortunate. Uh, I'm, I, like, I would like to be able to single target somebody, right, as Faye, but I'm just not able to. Well, I hope I have... I hope I'm getting a lot of Caustic regen. Yeah. Like that, where I get to E that guy three times, that's what I want. I'm just gonna Aegis this.
It is definitely time to leave. Okay, well, Greystone killing TB there is actually huge. That's actually ginormous. I wonder if I go... Oh, crown. I don't think I do. Do I need it? I probably do, right? Because I lose I lose 15% of my power. I should probably go Oak Crown. Like, I was thinking Wraith Leggings, but Oak Crown's probably just better. There's Synth Wave. Bro, honestly, Synth is something that should have not gone out of style, in my opinion. I just lost an Inhib. Right? Left go down, please. I don't have my ult. I don't know how I killed her. I actually don't know what killed that guy. Did, did she not get hit by my Q when I threw it down and she like hit the ground and got hit by it or what? I really want blue. I'm I'm just I'm actually just mana less if I don't have a blue buff right now. That's the one downside to this build, man. I, I, I don't know. The time warp definitely helps. Time warp plus Caustica feels pretty good. Last game when I didn't go time warp, I mean, I was I was actually just at permanently out of mana. I'll just base. If I'm gonna base, I have to do it now, so I might as well grab a grab a potent staff. Seize. It's a good song for a fight. This is a good song, man. This is a rock band song. The only thing I can think of when this song plays is playing uh playing playing guitar hero or rock band. I think the song was in both of them, but all that I that's all that I think about. Level 17. Pretty good. My offlaner is 18, but that's kind of whatever. My bubble! He's gonna try and play his flash, maybe? Oh, wait, he portals in? What? Okay. Did my Mirio just flash for me, actually? Did she just flash in to, to shield me? If she did, that was kind of gamer. I think it was unnecessary, but gamer. She's perma healing me with Wellspring and I'm full HP. Wellspring plus Prime buff. I'm actually full health in like 10 seconds. It's so nuts. Damn, Drongo got picked. He's just, he's the one that's alone over there. Our Primal's gone. The leave angle. I'm Uriel perma shielding me is so nice, actually. Just right clicking me, getting me out of here. I love it. Actually, it's actually really nice. Okay, this guy's like a like a damage build, my Greystone is, so I have to be a little a bit careful. His health bar is actually not as big as it normally is. He does still have two of them, but it's not huge, so I have to be a little careful. Could probably be paying attention to my team's builds before this point in the game, but... I think that full clear is when I have Prime. Ooh. I guess I'm just gonna go sit with my crunch. I should probably just be following my crunch around the map anyway, to be honest. Like he's he's the guy that's been making plays the whole game. I should probably just follow him and do what he does. A second gray buff? 
We've had first gray buffs. But what about second gray buffs? I think they saw me. It's fine. I don't care if they saw me, but I think they did. Just finished his two camp. Is he going to come in? Countess Flash. Just hitting who I can hit. Oh, big ult. Oh my god, that was so sexy. Holy shit. Is that a triple kill? Oh, oh, I didn't get the... I didn't get one of them. Get out of my way. My Greystone body blocked me. Our jungler's dead. I think we can do this. We just have to be a little bit careful. I grab this because I feel like it. That was actually a huge ultimate. I'm not going to lie. I held it long enough. There's some times where you don't want to hold fail, but I, I think that one... Like, again, I'm just... I was kind of zoned from the fight, right? I'm not walking... There's no way I'm just walking into Gideon ult. Kind of zoned off. I'm just holding my ult. I ended up with a three-man. It ends up working out really well. I'm going to base and grab blue. Oh, Morose wants blue. I'm going to base and finish and grab a tonic anyway. Extra mana regen, baby. 750 power, bro. That's actually nuts. This is actually insane. I mean, it's uh, it's 10 per or it's 15 from O Crown and 15 from Spellbreaker. This says 20. I don't think that's correct, but still. All right, 750, and that's with Tonic as well. I mean, that's pretty good. And Tonic solves my mana regen issues as well. Oh my gosh. Loving this game since it came to open beta. Any ideas on ranked? I think they were talking about summer for ranked. We don't have any dates, obviously. There's nothing hard that's been said. But I believe they were they that they have talked about summer ranked. I mean, Gideon just not walking into the fight is good enough for me. I don't need to do anything dumb. Like, I don't need to walk in too hard to the Gideon and, like, take damage or anything like that, right? Like, I can actually just stare at that guy, and he has to walk away. I have Primal, and I'm Fae. can finish, for sure. Trying not to get my bubble popped by Prime. Nice. Guys just cooked. Doesn't matter. I think TB's dead anyway. I'm gonna make sure that he's dead anyway. Where are you, TB? Damn. My crunch caught him first, bro. I was trying I was gonna chase him down. I was gonna chase him to the end of the earth. My crunch caught him first. Unfortunate for me, but what can you do? That should just be game. I didn't even use failed in that last fight, bro. Gee. This is a good game. Bro, maybe this fate builds OP. Any thinkers about that in chat? Maybe the double defense Fey build is the way to go. You just don't get insta-farmed in mid lane. You don't actually insta-die to every two-man that walks into your lane. Tips for someone who wants to stream. Uh, I would go watch, like, make, like double check all your settings, that kind of stuff. There's a lot of, there's a lot of stuff on YouTube, right, to check your settings. But just go in with, like, the mindset of what you want to do, right? Like, if you're looking... If you're someone who actually wants to grow as a streamer, like, you have to you have to think about it the correct way. It can't be, hey, I'm gaming anyway, so I'm going to stream. Like, you won't grow as a streamer that way, you know? If that makes sense? Like, you actually have to... Uh, you have to think about it the correct way when you start streaming.